Hi everyone, so I'm doing another winter walk, but do you know what? This park, in the summer, this is um, one of the best parks that I've walked in, but now <laughs> I'm looking and no, <laughs> but this is a winter walk, so I'm still going to walk around it. Um, now what's interesting, my sister said the other day, she said, no one wants to see these winter walks and no one's interested in you walking around a park. And I said, well, do you know what some people might be? And it's about the scenery and also the content because you're going to get the scenes and you're going to get a conversation, some motivational talks as well. So yeah, I'm disappointed because look at the trees. The trees are not like colourful like the other place. You can go to my YouTube channel, Marianne Hansen Counselling Service, where I did a winter walk. Actually, I might have put it on my other channel, Marianne Living Life, um, where I'm just going to go by the lake a bit so you get to see um, the scenes as well. Where the trees were beautiful. I, was, I, was, I, was, I went into that other part and the trees were just colourful and bright, but here, for whatever reason, no, I'm not getting the colour. Well, actually, I can see a tree over there that's colourful. Anyway, let's go on with my walk and talk because I've already spent a minute and I haven't said anything. What I want to talk about in this walk and talk is what are you willing to sacrifice to get what you want? So, how many people are willing to do the work and how many people are willing to sacrifice their sleep, sacrifice their time, sacrifice finances, you know, put in the emotional sacrifices that it takes to achieve the things that you want. Let's go over to a park that's a bit more, got a few things in there. That's the thing with some parks, to be fair, my sister's got a point with some parks. They've not got loads. Look at this, this is a little sculpture here. I don't know who these people are, but this is a really fancy sculpture. <laughs> Someone obviously designed that. And then you've got the park, um, lake behind me. In the summer, the lake is beautiful. Um, what are you willing to sacrifice? So, this is the time because we're coming towards the end of the year. Literally, we've got one month and one day until we're gonna be at the end of 2023. Can you believe that? So what are you gonna sacrifice? What is it that you really, really, truly want? I've started, especially as you get to a certain age, but also when you um, are firm on your decision, you realize this is it now. It's not about, oh, 2024 is going to be my year. And, oh, you know, all this stuff that people say. It's not about sound bites and just saying things. It's about actually following through. But first of all, recognizing this park is so big. I mean, I can't, I'm not going to be able to do a full walk and talk around this park because it is probably one of the biggest parks in Birmingham. And as you can see, there's loads of space to cover so I'll probably just do another two three minutes of the walk and talk and then I may come back here I may not we'll see what are you willing to sacrifice what is it that you've been giving 10% to instead of 100% what is it that you've been saying for years and years and years I'm going to do this but you just haven't done it so for me the other day I was sat there thinking I've just got to go for it now. So I've got my savings accounts for different things, my travel fund, my emergency fund, my quit my job fund. <laughs> um, there's so many, yeah, my business fund. You know, I've got my plans and it's not just about writing things down and then not going ahead and actually achieving them. It is about you saying, these are the sacrifices you're going to have to make. I mean, I'm up early today. I've been getting up at in fact, I've been getting up at between half five and six every day. I don't go for a walk every day, so I'm not going to pretend that I do. I get up, probably spend a bit of time getting ready and stuff, have breakfast, and then I start getting ready for my day. Now, I don't have to get up some days at half five or six because sometimes I haven't got appointments till the afternoon, but I choose to because I'll get more done. And I choose to because for me, I don't want to waste the day. So that's one of my sacrifices. I sacrifice the snooze button and I sacrifice sleep. Then another sacrifice I've made is um, I've made financial sacrifices because I've invested in things. 
I've made quite a lot of sacrifices this year but still I'm not where I want to be so I will continue to make those sacrifices until I get what I want. I've sacrificed time, time with people, I've sacrificed um, quite a lot so what you need to think about really is is it worth it to me? It's always going to be worth it until I get exactly what I want to get out of life and that might take the rest of my life and I'm going to continue to sacrifice things until I can get that so yeah I'm just getting freezing my hands actually I don't know if you if I turn the camera around you'd be able to see that I'm just breathing cold air my hands are frozen and it's too cold so I'm gonna stop right there but yeah think about what it is that you want to sacrifice to get the things that you want it is freezing um, so I wouldn't recommend a winter talk and a winter walk and talk unless you literally get some sort of um, padding and get your scarves, get your gloves on, get your hat on. This is proper winter weather now. See you soon. Bye.